Okay. Um, now, on this problem, the main important thing that we have is now we're getting into multiplication. And when we get into multiplication, the major thing that I want you guys to understand is, you know, make sure you guys understand the distributive property. Um, so when we're looking into doing um, to distributive property, the basic thing that we're doing is anytime we have a term outside of our parentheses, we need to make sure that we multiply that times everything inside of that parentheses. All right, now you guys can see all these lines. It starts to get a little bit of crazy, right? That's like a lot of distributive property. But the main important thing I want you guys to understand is this basically means 3x times x cubed plus 3x. I'm writing plus because that 3x is positive, OK? 3x times negative 2x squared plus 3x times 1 third x plus 3x times 4. All right, so now I have, you guys can see, I had to multiply 3x times every single one of those terms. Now, kind of like we were talking about uh, scientific notation, I'm just going to multiply my leading coefficients, and then my degrees, I'm going to use my rules of exponents. Well, here, the coefficient is 1, even though you don't see it written there. So 3 times 1 is 3. x times x cubed is x to the fourth. 3 times negative 2 is a negative 6. x times x squared is x cubed, so I have negative 6 x cubed. 3 times 1 third, those are reciprocals of each other. So that's this left with 1. And then I have x times x is x squared. And 3x times 4 is 12x. And there you go. Fine. Hey, like yep, you're multiplying, right? Steven, are you OK? You just seem like bored. Are you excited? <laughs>